Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Planet Nomads. And uh, yesterday, technically last night for me when I was rendering the video for this, I started thinking of a few things that was causing the issue, or uh, what, what was preventing it from uh, lifting up properly. And one of the viewers, and I, uh, kudos for you pointing this one out, because uh, a lot of people wouldn't get this. But the reason why it wasn't lifting up, and there's two reasons for it, we'll go over the, the main one here, is because I had the lift in the front. So what's happening, as, as these air blades are lifting up, since this, this uh, angled bar that goes up, that holds these, uh, this linkage here, what it's doing is it's lifting the front end up and it's pushing this rotor down so it's not lifting it up like it should it's basically trying to tw push it in on itself so what I'm gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these air blades off here and we're actually gonna try to mount them on the front another thing I was thinking about too and this is something I've had experience with this these blocks for a while is is, is it possible that it's not sliding what that's actually grabbing like the velcro and I might actually take this block out too and go from there but we'll we'll look at that afterwards because if i can keep this set up it would be perfect so anyways let's go ahead and uh get that out and that now we want we want the air blades on this section here because this is going to be the stationary horizontal piece and we do want to put it in the middle and we want to try to keep it as close to this as possible it's going to be a little ugly and i don't know why i'm on that bar it's a problem with going back and forth between saves is you never know where your hot bars are uh, if you're wondering why i do these regular saves when i do stuff uh, because the auto saves like to take over and if the autosave takes over, then you'll lose progress. Or you can't actually go back. And I was actually in the wrong spot, so we'll put that there. And we'll do that here. We just want to get two of them on here. We'll get rid of that. Finish these up. And I guess so. And then we'll put some air blades on top. Now, these are going to look a little funny. We can call him Mouse Ears. There we go. Call this guy the Mouser. Let's give him Pink Ears. There we go. Alright, now these come off. Like so. Now that should actually solve our issues. Now you have to connect. Are you even connected there? No, you're not. I thought I had connected there. So one, two, three. And then we go back to the generator. Now, hope, I'm going to leave that one at the bottom there because that will stop it from dropping down. Okay, good. Connected. Awesome. Oh, we got to get some fuel in here. Make sure everything is powered. Good. So we got power there. We got. Should have power down here. Oh, that's wrong button. Yeah, there we go. Okay, wheels are all powered. And it's a good thing I checked that wheel because I never did fix it. Okay, that's good. Now we can just go change direction on that. Get build vision off so it's not as laggy. We turn uh, that off. And with that there, I'm going to do a quick save. And that way, at least for at this point, we can work from here. Okay, all saved and done. I uh, had a bit of a nap to get rid of this godforsaken rain. It just never ends in this biome. We're definitely going to have to move the lab. Maybe we'll fly this thing right up to the lava fields. Put it up on stilts. Okay, so we drop it down. Uh, and in case anybody's wondering, my, sa my save file folder is about 3 gigs. <laughs> Doesn't say much until you hear that each save file is only about 20 megs. All right, so let's first see if we can drive. We can, wheels are all good. All right, so now, let's see if this was the culprit. Yeah, you, and go back in here, and... All right, what's going on here? Is 
to something is stuck and what I think it is that bad boy right over there let's try to do this somewhere where I don't get hurt oh a convenient hole can I actually reach okay I think I saw it move Still jam somewhere. I didn't cross any blocks. So I think it's probably right about there. And so let's take out this block here on either side. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I am an idiot. Tell me, tell me in the comments if you've already figured out what went wrong. I just realized what it was. I figured it out. Yes, I forgot to unlock everything. Of course. There we go. In fact, I better get back in here and lower those air blades down before this thing takes off like a rocket on me. Okay. Weird, that was supposed to, I thought they disabled the the hover while you're still in the well, when you come out of the cockpit. Okay. You're free. You're free. Oh, that's a good sign. It's always a good sign when it does go turn into a satellite orbiting the planet at a million miles an hour. And one more. And I realized I should have left that stop there, so let me reload. Okay, let's try this again. Mm. Alright, this time we'll do it right. First, I'm going to unlock everything. Give me a swing, thank you. We'll do the, the arms, the wing flaps, the doors, whatever you want to call them first. Did that... Get unlocked. There we go. Okay, that's free. That's free. And that's airborne. No. No, this is this isn't the old days. In old days I try to do something like this, I'd be dead by now. Twice over. Alright. Oh, I forgot to change that wheel, didn't I? Oh, I remembered. Good. Okay, let's do this again. I'm hopeful. Just in time for the rain. Alright, let's try to avoid that hole. That didn't work out too well. Now we'll bring it down here. And see if we can lift it up. Oh, I guess it helps if we turn it on, right? Alright, so... Okay. Oh, oh, that's a good, really good sign. I say that all the time. See, I'm wondering now if it's got to do with that sticking on those doors. You know what I mean? It's not pushing them out like I thought it would. So now I'll take those blocks out. Got a third person there. And out of the wheel well. Get rid of that. And that one. Get rid of these ones as well. Just just to be safe. Now in theory, 
the slope should move it out of the way. But this is Planet Nomads. Okay, I need to investigate and maybe this time it's a conveyor. Let's do qu one quick look together and then I'm gonna see what I can find. Yeah, I think that's it. Somehow it's binding. Alright, give me a minute. Let me see what I can figure out. Okay, I have had a little bit of success. Uh, put one more on there. I turned the one on the front off because I think that was still creating upward lift. So it is sort of working. But now we're getting that binding issue. And that's what I was worried about. So let's bring this back down. And let's actually get out before I hit the T button to bring out my tool. Let's get rid of that. Hmm. Let's try this, why not? So I think this should work. If not, I'm just going to take the take them off and we'll try it because it's it's working. I just hope it doesn't try to lift itself off the ground. More than likely it will, but all right, let's try this again. Up we go. Almost. Almost. Actually, you know what? I bet you if I put that corner on there now, it'll work. Oh, now we got binding. Alright. Now we have some fun. Some destructive fun. Okay, you're good. There you go. Go, that's better. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, it's almost there. Just needs a little bit more of a nudge. What is stopping it now? Probably just not enough power from the air blades. It looks like everything's free. There's definitely something clipping. Oh, I see what it is. I'll bring it back down. One more quick modification. We'll get rid of that block and that one. And we'll do the same on the other side. And I think this should work. Let's get a nice view of this. Yeah, right here. There we go. Like an eagle. And I should have put some stops on the other side. And it still drives. Let's uh, zoom out a little. Nice. Now let's see if we can get this bad boy back down. Haha, <laughs> love it. Let's put a few stops on here. Uh, see, persistence pays off. As long as you don't give up, things will work out. Um, hmm. I think... Let's do... I think here. If I do it there, well, it doesn't matter where I do it, I gotta do multiple blocks yet out. Unless. We just do something like that. No, that won't work. Because then it makes it too heavy on this side. 
Hmm. Well, let's t go back up and see what happens. Pay attention to what they do. I could actually put them right on the air blades. And it hasn't broken yet. I am surprised. Who knows what I'm going to be able to do with the new Unity. Alright. So now we just put a couple blocks here. And that way it should stop it from folding all the way back. And like so. Back in. Bring her up. Spread your wings and fly. There we go. Officially my first transformer. Working. Doesn't look as good as I was expecting it to. But considering what I'm trying to do with what we have in the game, I'd have to say this is and have a remarkable success. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I thank everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed, don't uh, if you enjoyed, don't forget to leave me a like, and I will see you in the next one. Later.